Hi, I'm Epoch and in this video I'm going to show you exactly how fishing works in Dinkum. Now, first off, you need a permit if you don't know just yet. So first off, just go do some milestones, go collect some bugs, go farm some stuff, just go run. And you're going to get some milestones done, you're going to get some permit points and that you can spend at Fletch for a permit. If you get the permit for the fishing, basically you can go to John, who is a shopkeeper, and basically buy a fishing rod over there for like 1,200 uh, dings. Uh, you can get that in no time. And once you get your fishing rod, well, you basically just want to go to a river. Now, right now, we just need to go look for a fish in the river. So you just kind of want to run around the edge and just kind of look if you see a fish in the river. And the moment that you see one, you kind of just want to stop on the side. Now, how deep that the fish is, that doesn't really matter in this game. Once you actually found the fish, you can basically just stand on the side, select your fishing rod on your tool belt, and just hold down the left mouse button. The longer that you hold it down, the further he's going to cast the line. Now, it's, if it's actually too far away from the fish, basically you can kind of reel it in, so kind of push it closer with the left mouse button, or you can just cancel the cast entirely with the right mouse button, and you can try again. Once you are actually close enough to the fish, you actually are going to see him come up closer to the cast and you are going to hear and see him slightly, but I kind of hear him better, nibble. And when he's nibbling, you don't really want to do anything. But when he really makes that splash, that really kind of clear sound that he is actually taking a bite, you actually want to start reeling in. So you want to press the left mouse button. Now, during the reeling in, well, probably a lot of people are going to go wrong. I kind of went wrong my first few times because you can actually lose the fish at this point. The moment that you actually have the bite, you actually want to reel him in while he's not fighting. When he's kind of splashing, you don't want to reel him in because that way you are actually going to have this toolbar on the right side appear. Now, you are going to see this little bar decrease quite quickly in my opinion. At the, at the top it's kind of full, at the bottom it's empty, and when it's actually empty, the fish is going to get away. So basically you only want to hold the left mouse button when he's not fighting. The moment you don't hear any splashing, you don't really see like this white water flopping up from the screen, well basically you just want to start pushing the left mouse button and kind of reel them in. Now there's always a set tempo, if you can see that, and basically there are always like two seconds of fighting, two seconds of peace, and during the two seconds of peace that he's not fighting, you can actually bring him closer to you. You want to do this as much as possible without never reeling him in while he's fighting and once he actually gets close enough to you well your character is going to automatically pick it up and that way you have a fish and that is how fishing works in dinkum let's talk about some early game tips that you may want to know when playing dinkum just check that video out right here but don't click on it just yet be sure to subscribe if you want to stay up to date on everything dinkum related thanks for watching i'll see you over there